right, so guys, we have a beautiful morning. Well, not really, but it was an overcast morning. Pleasant day, you know, it was fairly cool. We have a visitor in the means of Hurricane Matthew that was just starting to get to the lower eastern quadrant of the state. Um, and it was starting to create some ran, uh, r rain bands and, of course, a little overcast. More overcast on this day than anything. So I didn't have anything scheduled prior earlier in the morning, so I asked my wife, she wouldn't mind uh, coming out to the Skyway Fish Pier so we could go ahead and finish the part two video of how to do your trolley rig or how to set up a trolley rig. Because if you're familiar, last week I did how to make the rig for the trolley rig, and I just wanted to go in um, to a detailed video and show you how to set up everything up from A to Z. So as you see here, we're driving on 41. Everything's good. We're all happy, go lucky, and you know, normal, typical type of day. So we get over to the fishing pier, and it is blowing. I'm not going to deny that, you know. And I was expecting some mild gusts, but honestly, it, w it wasn't as bad as I I I thought it was going to be. So. We started filming, and we really go through, we get, we capture some great footage, and unfortunately you won't be able to see because I wasn't filming using the SD card, I was filming using the internal memory of the camera. But we collected some great footage, filmed for about 30 minutes, probably 25-30 minutes, and I walked back to the truck, and I, and my wife, who has the camera on the tripod right next to the pier, the edge of the pier, decided to leave the the camera unattended, a gust of wind came through and blew it right over. And as you can imagine, I'm pretty furious at this point. Uh, but you know, what's been done has already been done. So, you know, I tell her to go up to the bait store. Of course, I forgot my cast net. You know, we don't have the laptop or anything. We weren't prepared to fish. I was just coming out here focused on the video tutorial itself, and that was it. So I asked her to run up to the bait store. And see if they have a cast net and maybe even a um, you know a snatch hook that we could utilize to see if we could capture at least our tripod and maybe salvage the film off the SD card. Well, two hours later, I could not get anything. This cast net that they, the guy loaned us, which was very nice at home, every single braille line was broken, so it was pretty much useless. Um, so at this point, you know I'm pretty frustrated. I decide to pack it up and go, get to the house. I grab the computer, laptop, make sure I have all the GoPros, and I get my cast net, which is a Tim Wade 10 foot cast net. Well, I dropped the GoPro down, which you can see here. I didn't get anything on the first drop, so I was wondering maybe if the current had taken it. On the second drop, I captured this footage. You can see it's already got a bunch of new inhabitants. Uh, it's pretty much Mother Nature taking over and uh, taking back what's rightfully hers. But I was excited to see it on that GoPro. I, I took it out of the mini SD card and, and popped it in the computer, saw the video. I made one cast and got the camera back. But as you can see here, guys, I mean, anything in salt water, especially for two, three hour period, I mean, it literally eats it up. I wasn't expecting to salvage the camera. But what I was expecting to do is hopefully save the SD, get my tripod back, and so forth. So you see here, not very pretty. The tripod actually was just fine. Nothing wrong with the tripod at all. Uh, I washed it off, dishwashing detergent, uh, fresh water, sp and sprayed it down with WD-40. Anyhow, guys, this is what happened to my $1,200 camera. It may be a few days till you see a new video. I did order some new a new camera, which will come in any day, and I'll get right back on top of things, get some videos pumping out here. So give a thumbs up, guys, and uh, comment below. If you haven't subscribed, guys, subscribe. You never know what kind of craziness you'll see on this channel. Until next time, we'll see you on the water.